DJ Schneider's a friend of mine. Met him a couple of years ago at uh, Blade Show 15, 2015, Atlanta, Georgia. This is a brand new Skull Crusher SXB. Oop, still got the plastic on the handle. I bought five of them. Uh, 2016 Blade Show. Tops, knives, EJ Snyder. EJ made me a letter uh, of uh, authenticity. Knife number five, six, seven, eight, and nine. I sold six and seven. My daughter has number five. This is number nine, but I'm going to start using it. EJ signed it. And it's number nine. So I am going to talk about it a little bit. I'm going to use it. Whack on uh, the tree here. I've been at this tree before. But right now, oh my gosh, that thing looks sharp. Factory sharp. Yeah, it's pretty sharp, all right. This is Brad. So we're going to mess with this knife a little bit. Over time, I'm going to do some uh, other reviews and things with it also. E.J. Snyder, Naked and Afraid, Lost, 40-Day Challenge, XL, uh, Dual Survival with Jeff. I was asked to sharpen an axe from Harbor Freight. So I went and bought an axe. It's actually a four and a half pound, that's a heavy axe. People say, well, you need to get a six or seven pound axe. Yeah, right, swing that for a little while. So anyway, I'm gonna sharpen it right now. And I gotta walk around the tree. something to hold my paper. Sharpen spark. And the axe. That's kind of cool, I got a rubber cover. Oh my God, that is a typical ax today. If you worked at it, you could cut yourself, but you'd have to work at it. Well, let's do the paper test. Okay, I can kind of saw the paper. So, let's get to work and see if what I can do with my sharpened spark. Then later, I'm going to reprofile it. It's really thick. And uh, I'll, I'll use my sander on that. Reprofile it and show you what I can do then. And it is thick.
when I go slow and put a little pressure on it, I actually cut little tiny little glistens of metal off of the blade. Now if I had about an hour, I'd really cut this blade down. All right. Let's polish the blade a little bit. And let's see if I made a visible change. That's better.